Hello everyone, Kree here, Remake Nakamoto Top Lane, and today we are against a Quinn. I could care less about you. Relax. Why do you have to take that secondary? Like, I mean, because of that, she actually missed out on XP. She should just walked with me rather than doing damage, but it's whatever. So I am ahead of her. So we are, I'm, half, I'm halfway to level 2. She just got 1 minion, so she's getting there, right? But yeah, we are against Quinn. The runes are currently going to press attack. Chomp, Bell Knight, Kudir, Grass. We have Shield, Bash, Plus, Psycho, Win. So into Quinn, I did, in fact, take... And she's afraid. I did, in fact, take double armor, double armor right here. So we have an extra 12, which is really solid. It's going to be really good into this girl. Because she will try poking me out and all that good stuff. Where's her auto range? It's level 2, but I can't really fight it until I'm level 3, which is pretty nice. Pop this potion here. We do have Psycho Wind plus uh, Doran Shield to give us that nice juicy sustain. I really do have to start hitting these Ws, though. This is going to be very important, this matchup. Because hitting W means sustain. She, <laughs> she eat a minion. Nice. That works out. Once a level 3, I can actually go for a, a gauge on her. Because believe it or not, you, once you're on top of someone like Quinn, you actually can one shot her. But, obviously, she's a champion that has, you know, a vault that escapes, and that, that really sucks to go against. I want to try timing my Ws with the uh, minions on her. But she ain't gonna walk up for that one. Wow, the Malusi she gets on a Harrier Pox is insane. I didn't even notice that. I'm gonna auto queue this. She can vault me if she wants, but that's fine. Don't really want to eat for no reason. I'll be rushing into Tabby, obviously, because, you know, Quinn is Quinn. But it's okay. Wave is still pushing me. Did he get the double buff, by the way? He still has red buff, so... Did a refresh. Nah, he didn't get he didn't get this red buff, unfortunately. Ah, oh, that's fine though. Wave slow pushing into me. They went one for one. Interesting. Let's get this. Oh no, they go one for one. He got the elites. Not bad, dude. Not bad. Ping MIA, he's afraid. He doesn't know. Come on. Elise. Why you gotta do this to me, man? I've done nothing wrong. You don't have to clear my wards now. <laughs> so whatever. Uh you don't wanna fight that. You don't wanna fight that. Walk away, brother. Can't help you out. I'll help you out now though. Nice flash. He's still gonna die though. Oh no. On my way. I'll be taking you out. She's zoom. Oh, you're so fast. What is this? She's so fast. Whatever, man. I'm really happy you slowed me. I really am. <laughs> that champion's so fast, dude. I'm gonna go over here just in case he's actually backing right here. Oh, she actually did. She, was, she backed so early. Alright, whatever. I mean, to be fair, I'm just not moving fast enough. These minions are immediately on me, man. That really sucks. But we did get double, which is pretty good. I, like I said, I will rush Ninja Tabby on my back. That's going to help out. It's going to be really important. But for now, I can't back yet. I do have to come over here and pick up this wave. Because if I back in TP, it's not worth it. I can just come over here now, clear this wave, then TP. If I need to, but I doubt it. Because the wave is going to slow push into me. I cancel my auto. Whatever. I have this go under turret. There's no way she tanks it. It's too much damage. But she should hit level 5 off this wave. Whereas I'm, you know, I'm getting there. See, so looking at their team. Tabby's going to be their main source of damage in terms of ADC, right? So we will buy this, like I said. I do have TP. Oh, that's unfortunate. If she gets out, I can TP. Oh? She's okay, nice. Keep walking topside over here. Yeah, if there was a ward over here or here, then it'd be a really good TP. But another issue is that my E wasn't up. That kind of sucks. But yeah, into Quinn, I actually do maxi. Just because she can't really dodge it using her vault. I mean, if she wants to, she can vault a minion, right? But the thing is, if your your E and her vault collide, you actually interrupt her vault, believe it or not. So, your because your E has knockback priority, which, which, whereas hers doesn't, which is really good. And what I mean by knockback priority is pretty much uh, one knockup one knock is stronger than the other. For example, if you were to E into Gragas, his knockup will overpower yours, and you'll be the one who gets knocked up instead. So keep that in mind. Against her, you have knockup priority, which is pretty nice. And I will watch Tabby, it's going to reduce the majority of your damage. We do have press the attack. You could go Arcane Combat if you want to, but she can just W every time. She can, not W, but she can vault your W every single time, and it's not it's not fun at all. Auto Q to this. Out of this. 47 damage. <laughs> that actually did zero. What the hell? I know I understand it was the AoE, so it does less damage, but it still did nothing overall. Shim in the minion wave so I can hopefully maintain the freeze, which I should be able to. Gonna take quite a bit of damage here, but not the end of the world. Auto Q, nice ping am I. Oh no 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 no. Yeah, that's unfortunate. T ping in. Oh, I'm six, I'm six. 
Riot! Riot! She's so fast. What is this? She has a boot item, man. Whatever. I wish this guy looked at his minimap. He would have saw that this girl ulti would be on her way. She has two kills now, unfortunately. Like, the thing about Quinn is, like, whenever you're against someone like Quinn or Pantheon, you have to be aware of the map yourself. You know? Because I can't, I can't constantly ping. That's one thing. I just, I personally, I just can't constantly ping. Especially when I was just way too focused on, you know, actually maintaining a freeze, which I did, and it worked out, but now the freeze is actually broken. I have to back here in TP, unfortunately, just because if I am in this lane with Quinn, when I'm at half HP, she can easily just run me down. I don't know if she ignited or not. I don't want to miss Cannon, though. That's, that's the one thing I don't want to miss. But honestly, Zach can come topside. Right here, this should be free for him. My boy, what are you doing? You're not even doing scuttle. W wake up. <laughs> wake, uh, wake up just a little bit, my good friend. Whew! Nice dodge by me. I gotta walk away. I can't do that. Oh, you get out? I think you get out. Uh, Kasten's right here. He's coming up soon. Oh me, oh me, oh me, oh me, oh me, oh me. Nice. <laughs> I appreciate you, my good friend. Alright, nice. Let's back here and let's go into a sheen. I was gonna go for double longsword, but no reason to anymore. Now they actually have the gold for a sheen now. Because we did get that kill on the Quinn. This wave's still pushing out. She's not gonna miss anything because she has her ultimate, unfortunately. But it's fine. Not the end of the world. Start eating here. Does she retrieve it? Ah, oh, she actually froze it. That's actually really unfortunate for me. But now that she was having Ignite, I actually go for a short trade in her. But whenever I do this, decide to disengage the short trade, I need to do it when my passive shield is up. That way she doesn't return that much damage onto me. As I go down here, Lane's doing her thing. She's level 6. Leo's also level 6. Silas is on his way. He's going to steal the Leona ultimate, and it should be good. Steal low ultimate. I'm going to type it just so he actually knows. Uh, 3 points in the queue. Definitely more than enough. I can't see! Haha! -ha. Alright. I didn't want to E blindly into her, because if I miss, it's just gonna suck, right? Because she could she could have been like pathing that uh, perpendicular to me. To actually dodge something. She's sitting really far back. She's not trying to give me those uh, traits. She knows I can like bring a world of pain into her right now. Tag her there, really important. You pop her over your shield. I didn't even get my Q2 off, dude. So unfortunate. That's the one thing I don't like about Quinn. She, her vault, you know, in terms of her auto attack. It really does suck, but, you know, happens. It makes sense, right? It's a knockup. Do this again if he wants to. Sass is on his way. I have ult up in 20. Let them know. Done. Nice. Nice flash. Not gonna matter. Nice. Good job, team. Very good job. Now, I know what you guys are thinking. Kree, Kree, your team is helping you against this Quinn. Alright, man. It's a team game. <laughs> like, it's, li it's literally a team game. I'm not gonna be ashamed of my team helping me. <laughs> literally, by no means. I've made plays with them. they made plays with me. There's nothing to be ashamed of. Alright, let's keep shoving this out. Because I do want to go for my uh, phage. And shoving this wave is going to be important. That way, the next wave that's coming up, it focuses on the turret. And also, you know, it's not sitting outside of turret range, which is pretty cool. Nice, we got it. Let's back off here. My bot lane didn't win that fight, unfortunately. Not the end of the world, though. Because Silas did TP, though, we they don't get as many planes as they show, which is pretty nice. And now that I have phage, I should be able to one me water. When she does have Ignite, of course, because Ignite is actually pretty strong. We have this. Let's start moving here. Thank you for the bubble. I cre appreciate it, beautiful. How's it going? This guy's taking farm. I like He is going to send a I like that. He realizes that we have more than enough damage on our team, and there's literally no reason for him to go damage himself. For example, Blood Razor. So goodbye. He's dead. That pathing looked weird. It looks like he's going to go to him. Oh, she's MI. Spamping this. So my status is aware. It could be getting roamed on. Keep pinging. He's being really aggressive for someone who doesn't know where Quinn is. <laughs> Quinn, MIA. Safe. Play safe. 
let them know. My dad is having an argument on the phone. Come on, man. There's no reason to be so loud. I'm hearing the phone. <laughs> I don't know. There's Elise. So Elise did try ganking. Uh, I feel like Elise is going to try making a play topside here. So I am going to drop my ward over here. Oh, hey. How's it going? See, she was mid side. I don't want to walk up for this. I don't know where Elise is. It's not worth it. I will start moving down here, though. And I don't think. At least, I think Elise might be on her red cards. Something like that. Ah, all right, that's pretty good. We got a splash. So cast flash will be coming up at 1720. All right, down here, down here, down here. Oh, press E. Nice, I'm walking down as well. Uh, this guy's TPing. All right, nothing's happening. All right, nice, we just leave. Don't go for anything more. And now we start eating back top lane because obviously we don't want to be missing stuff, right? Either so you get there as fast as possible, so you miss the least amount of going to XP as possible. Look at XP value, actually. I can actually kill her at that range. That's actually really good for me. Sucks out, Sabi, though. Wish it was a Berserker Greaves. Oh, you're so greedy. What the hell? Ha. <sighs> I hate her. Too much movement speed for me, man. I thought she'd be walking straight up, but no, she went that way. Like, it, it's just how it is when you get blinded, unfortunately. My E was coming up, probably, but whatever. Still gonna flash for it. Then, you know, don't give it a chance, because I think her flash is coming up, maybe. I'm not entirely sure. I actually didn't time it, unlike, you know, I timed Cassidy's, which is coming up at 1720. So, yeah. She's the flash. I forgot the time. <laughs> it's fine, though. Keep showing this out. Once I get Triforce, I should have an easy time into her. QQ again. I would love one more plating riot. I'd appreciate it if I could get it off this. It'd give me Triforce. And I'd just be able to stomp her. QQ again. Nice. And let's back away here. Really good. She actually went for the wave too. She's not focused me, which I appreciate. You're annoying. You're so annoying. You're not gonna get me. Relax. <laughs> Stop trying to be annoying, woman. God damn. Leave me alone. I'm just trying to back here and spend my gold. It's whatever. I mean, I was gonna have to wait a bit of gold anyways in base so it doesn't really matter that she interrupted me and i will tp here anyway so it's not like i'm missing out on too much so actually i won't tp if she wants to get plating or she wants to take down the turret sure by all means because drake is coming up and i do want to save my tp for that and i think quinn just realized that she is at my a so instead i'm actually going to be uh, pathing down the drake myself so i don't have to waste my tp Yep, smart. I mean, I did ping, so it's so unfortunate he let himself get traded like that, but it's whatever. I guess it happens. Just don't fight, guys. Leona's also here. I'll be taking that cannon. Don't worry, guys. I'll make sure we get the cannon. I will make sure. Uh, Quinn's around here. They're looking to do this. Yeah, like, their entire team is bot side. Make sure we shove this out. Nice. They already got the vein because she's by herself without the Leona. Good job, team. Gotta be a little bit careful with them trying to make a play on me. Good job, my Jax. If Jax didn't do that, honestly, I wouldn't have killed him. I mean, I would hit him with the, I would hit him with a W. I don't know if he'd live or not, but we can just do this now. I'm gonna start this. Make sure I help him with this. I'm taking it. He took my kill. That's all I'm saying. He, he did. He did. Even though he did help me, he still took my kill. So you know, I gotta, I gotta tax him. Tax the jungler. It's only fair. W does 10,000 damage. Make sure you always do that. And let's back here. Obviously, this wave, shoving out to her. Obviously, I missed a big wave because I did roam, you know, and all that good stuff. But it was for the greater good. We do secure the dragon for our team, which is pretty good. And we got a bot lane turret on top of that, so not bad. So, double longsword here. It's going to be going into our TM at, obviously. What else would be going into? Well, you could go Death Stand second item. It's not as good as it once was because, obviously, you get least a D now. But, you know, you s sorry about that. You still get the same sense of survivability, which is also pretty good. It's not bad at all. Especially to someone like Quint, where, like, if you get armor early, it kind of sucks to be her. <laughs> and she'll do a lot less damage. So who knows? Maybe I might go with just because their AP champs are fed as well, so it would actually help into their team as well. He's a double long goes in these components, so it's fine. Point into ult. Pink she's MIA. Be careful. I can walk up here. I'm not afraid. Shove this out. Because remember, I can 100-0 her now. She can't 100 zero me because I can just press E away and it'll be hard, right? But once I have ultimate, I can 100 zero her. 
And look how little damage he did. <laughs> Your autos are finally not hurting anymore. Uh, Jax on my way. We win this. Win this really hard. W? Nice, I slowed her. She can't go anywhere. She's right here. You guys got it, and I'm right here. I think he's still dead. Comorado attack, nice. W. Ha! I mean, I had, the, I had the W for damage, I guess, I think. And I got slowed. What are you doing? He W'd a minion. <laughs> Did he die? No, he just instantly backed. This guy was like half HP. Why'd you leave, man? Or whatever. He got a wood turn. I actually like that buy. I really do. I will continue with this purchase, by the way. It's going to be really nice. Really solid. But yeah, turret just destroyed me. Quinn path this way, unfortunately. I mean, it's whatever. It's going to happen. I will TP top in here just to apply some pressure. Or he's going to go top lane, so I don't have to TP, unfortunately. It's whatever. <laughs> just proto the wave. Under break and sandable. I'll just be running my lane over here. Oh, wait. Let me get a control word. Because that's always important. Setting up vision control around the map. Never forget about that. But anyways, let's start moving. Ah, just cracked everything. Good luck, bud. Thank you. I don't know who this person is, but I will say thank you. <laughs> let's see. He's really tanky, so I can't go for 100 zeros anymore, but I still beat him the 1v1 for now. Nice W. I gotta be careful here. Nice perma CC. What? Now you're not getting out. No. Oh. She missed. That works out. <laughs> man, this guy really thought he was going to get out. Come on, man. Not today. Not today. You thief, man. What'd I do to you? You don't want to take my cannon, dude. <laughs> Straight thievery, dude. I'll be taking that, though. I don't know, ultimate's always gonna be good for us. Shove this out. I'm gonna go top lane now. Stick around a little bit so I get the gold. Okay, I missed the gold, unfortunately, but whatever. Let's start moving up here, though. Uh, I'm not gonna control Ward the jungle because look where Leona's pathing. She's obviously gonna come walk over here and hit that. So, nothing not worth it. I will control Ward this, though. Oh, see you later. <laughs> you see what I mean by you just 100 to 0 here now? There's, there's just nothing she can do. As long as you survive the matchup. Obviously, like, even though my team did help me, I, otherwise, the recording probably would just be me playing passive, which isn't very fun, mind you. But, yeah, you just generally be playing passive. I'm gonna walk in this way. Ha! Dude. He's actually autumn, which is really good. Nice. Good job. This guy's teeping. I'm gonna be a little bit careful about this. Just because, obviously, I don't have the MR this guy has. Well, he doesn't have MR either. He's just very tanky. This guy actually could potentially one-shot me. Yo, heal me. Me, me, me. Heal me. No heal? No heal? Okay. You too. Nice. Walk this way. How's it going, beautiful? Honestly, I can't get you. But I will go over here for this plating, which is pretty nice. Not plating, but turret. And let's shove this out now. I'll be taking that cannon good, sir. How far are we from Death's Dance? Actually, not that far at all. If I actually killed that Leona, I would've gotten it. Which would've been pretty nice. She's over here. She can honestly easily kite me out. Not worth. I think she'll face check me. Nah, she's going down here. Quinn's down here. Ping it. Let's go for this now. I will obviously stay here. That way I have vision of their team. This actually might be warded, by the way. Because I don't see why Leona wouldn't ward this on her way. But let's doink some of this girl's gold. Nice. Uh, she's chilling here by herself. I'm gonna drop a word over here. Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna bother walking there. <laughs> I'm not gonna bother walking there. That was just a bad siege on my team's part. It's not the way you siege that turret. I mean, they got it nonetheless, but, you know, at the cost of our Jax's shut them. Worth? Probably not, because we, we could always use Herald some other time, right? But it's whatever. Quinn's toppling by herself, otherwise... The reason why I know is because she would have walked up if she did have someone with her. Oh, this one's more. And that's it's back here. 
Oh, wait, she did have Leona here. They just didn't want to fight. All right, that's interesting. I feel like if Leona had ult, I just died, but all right. Because I'd just be perma CC. There's nothing you can do about CC. Buy this. Pretty good. And now we'll go into Tenekaja. I personally think the Karja is honestly the best way to go with the uh, Death Stance, just because they pair up really nicely. Just because it's survivability. Like, you get a burn or damage from taking damage over time. And the more HP you have, then, you know, the longer you can survive that burn and all that good stuff, right? So I do think it's a nice, it's a nice pair. I always like Titanic character Death Stance. It makes you really tanky. And then you go for a Stairs Gauge on top of that, and then all of a sudden, you can't die. And then, you know, Bloodthirster, all that good stuff on top of that. Pretty, pretty, pretty good. Let's see, you have 10% life still so far, not bad, but obviously Death Stance does heal you as well, right? 50% heal you for 50% damage dealt, so that does count as 50% life steal. So in reality, I'm at 25%. <laughs> My dad. <laughs> My father. I think he might be talking on speaker, which probably makes sense, but whatever. Can't be that lazy. I am here though, shadowing my boy. The fight is breaking out. He's made two really bad plays so far. That's kind of dicey. But we can't go for this turret now. Because we see their entire team down there. Like, yeah, we just pushed for objectives here. Which is really good. Like, they're going to be going for Baron, but we're about to get two Indip turrets. Like, that's going to be a really good trade for us. Considering we're already far enough ahead. Focus this down, buddy. We do more than enough damage. Oh, they actually didn't get that? That's tragic. We get this and back off. Really good. You're not going to do anything. Relax. You auto me once. <laughs> Relax. Like, all I'm saying is, if you're not going to commit, you might as well not auto me all and let me breathe. You know what I'm saying, guys? But whatever. This guy has to be a little bit careful. Ooh. Oh, don't mind if I do. Uh... Like, when I go troll... Keep autoing, Jinx. You do damage. I'm also, you know, taking up a storm for you. Oh, you lived. <laughs> and then he smited. See what I mean? Death stance. I was so tanky. They all focused me, but to no avail. I took zero damage, and we could just... Actually, I don't know what you can do in bot lane. But, nonetheless, Death Stance, like I said, made me extremely tanky there. If I had, if I had a Titanic Hydra instead, I would have taken a lot more damage than I already did. And obviously we lifted for quite a bit. So it works out perfectly for us. Thank you for that. We'll get Inhibitor here, and we should be able to go for this one. So two Indims at 24 minutes, pretty good. My farmer's atrocious. Yeah, we know how to respect the Quinn, not take too much damage from her. Understandable. Auto Q. The only time at least all was useless. You get one of each ability? Yes, she does. I mean, he. It's a he. <laughs> it's definitely a he. Leash me, Nami! Okay, don't throw your bubble. <laughs> as much as I would appreciate it, don't throw your bubble. I mean, once I get TM out, doing camps like this is just so free. They're very easy. But I might as well take them out if they're already there, right? So let's back off. We'll be getting our... I thought I pressed back one, but I guess not. But we'll be getting our Dragon Soul here. Good jump on her. Honestly, it's not worth it. It's just more important that I spend my gold here. Buy these two items. Let's start zooming and moving. 7 and 1. But I am 8 and 1, which is pretty cool. But I think... I do have more KP overall, but she has 700 gold. I mean, she can afford to, right? She has all the time in the world to farm, whereas I'm over here making picks on my boy Silas. You know, we're making plays. Uh, he's okay. How's it going, beautiful? The one unfortunate thing, one unfortunate thing about Vayne is that she does true damage, and so when she targets you, even with Death Stance on, she does a lot of damage. <laughs> but yeah, that was really unfortunate, but whatever, it worked out. Let's back off here, and let's go for that Mountain Drake. We had a really good pick happen. If I had Legend Tenacity here, I can easily uh, ult right after Leona stuns me, but I don't have Tenacity or Merchant, so it's whatever. I do think the Tabby Bite was definitely worth it for these two. Because even though Vayne's 1 and 6, she still does a lot of damage. Let's get this now. Quinn, baby, what is you doing? Absolutely nothing. Please walk away. <laughs> ah, she repelled before my Q2. She canceled my Q2 with her repel. 
I didn't expect their team to be here because why would they contest? Like there's like look, this is what this is why. Why would they contest? Because this would just happen. We we literally just stomped them. But you know, they did contest, so whatever. I guess it works out for me. And just like that, that's gonna be the end of the game. So that's a bad matchup for Camille. Quinn. Like, 100%. If Gwyn plays perfectly, there's really not much Camille can actually do. It's, you know, you just gotta survive lane and get the kills. But if you, obviously, if your laners do come help you, your jungle, your Silas, whatever, whoever your laner is, if he does come, it's very free matchup. Like, if you actually, if you end up going even once you're level 6, you actually can't hurt your zero her, so do keep that in mind. If you ever are against a Quinn, you're like, ah, oh, shit, she locked in Quinn, man, my lane's over. Not at all. Just don't tilt, play safe, and you will be good. Let's TP in because I do want to be in this picture after all. So, your TJ played. Like, comment, comment, and subscribe. We'll see you guys next video. Peace! And we got a double explosion. Let's go!